hi everybody as we are looking into our archives to find things to give you as every week as much as possible about the history of our theater and the amazing productions we've done until this point before we can actually get back to you doing the work we love We've been finding a lot of interesting things. I mean, I am so proud of the work over the past 15 years, and it's amazing, the brilliant people that have worked here and produced such incredible work. And, you know, we've done seven new musicals, seven world premieres of new musicals, and many of you subscribe to the preview process because you want to know how things develop. You come and see them in previews, and then you come and see the shows later after they've settled in and, and had all the changes made. And one of the things that happens in the preview process is the directors often at the first and second previews, they talk to the audience about how, you know, things could go wrong. We may have to stop the show. Some of the things are being tried for the first time. You all, many of you out there know the drill and you love the excitement of that possibility. And looking back over the directors that have given pre-show speeches before previews, including myself and, uh, and, and many other wonderful directors. There is a hands down winner for the very best pre-show curtain speech. And uh, I have to say it goes to Jeff Calhoun before the preview of Bonnie and Clyde. He absolutely is the hands down winner. So why don't you enjoy that right now? <laughs> And Michael, do they know it's our first preview? Because in New York, you only come to a first preview when you want to see a train wreck. <laughs> it's all the jaded people that can't wait to see all the mistakes. But let me tell you, first and foremost for us tonight, besides entertaining you, is to be safe for the cast. We have never, I probably shouldn't tell you this, we've never tried to go from the beginning to the end. <laughs> I'm glad you have a sense of humor. <laughs> That's what we're going to try to do tonight. But chances are you're going to see me again. Because if we have to stop, I'm going to come out and talk to you. Because this is a very big show. I mean, it's a big show. There's guns, there's blood, there's fast changes, there's movement. It's a dangerous thing, and so safety is first. And thank God that you guys know about previews, so you will be understanding. We're going to learn a lot. We don't open until a week from tonight. So based on your reaction, if you like something, please let us know. Don't be shy. And if you don't, we will fix it, and it will be better tomorrow night. Because we rehearse every day for the next week, and the show will change every single night. But anyway, we are really thrilled to be here on... Um, I have so many friends, Trevisos. How many of you have eaten at Trevisos? It's my new favorite restaurant. I know all the waitresses, Carol and Chris, and Pat. In the balcony, are you there? With her daughter from Boston High. And John is in E. Where's John? Oh, you're new live. You said you were the orchestra. OK. So I'm making friends all the time. I like the new roundabout at five points. What do you think? <laughs> I hope you enjoy. Have I forgotten anything? Oh, here's the one thing our writer wanted me to tell you. Think of tonight as sex with the lights on. <laughs> You're going to have a good time, but you may see some things you shouldn't. <laughs> 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 